Hey, Brookie Babies, and welcome back to another vlog. If you're new here, welcome. Go ahead and hit that red subscribe button. Join the Brookie Baby gang, because the Brookie Babies are lit. We have fun, and if you subscribe, you're going to have some fun too. So, you guys, I'm so excited about this video. As you can see from the title, today your girl is going to be showing you how to become that girl routine. Basically, I'm going to be showing you my how to become that girl routine. I'm super excited about this video. Y'all know I love routine videos, and I had one of my subscribers reach out. Well, a couple of you have reached out and requested more routine videos, but I had one subscriber in particular that reached out and just asked me to do a video kind of like on self-care a little bit of maintenance and just how I feel confident or feel good on certain days I was like you know what I've been seeing this video going around I love them and I was like let me do that let me do a how to become that girl routine my way and then throw in everything else that I do because what I love about these videos is that basically if you're like what does becoming that girl mean every version of that girl is going to be different okay so what i do to become that girl is not going to be exactly the same as what you do to become that girl everybody is different in their own way so what i'm doing in this video y'all may say well that's not enough to become that girl for you but for me this is what i do to feel like i'm that girl so this video is for motivational purposes only because everybody's is going to be different. If you feel like waking up, drinking your, which I am, hot tea, journaling, and laying down on the couch all day watching your favorite movies make you feel like you're that girl because you're in your most peaceful setting, you are that girl. Nobody can tell you what that definition means to you, but only you. I just wanted to put together this video to motivate you guys and show you that it doesn't matter what your routine consists of, there are small things that you can do to feel like you are that girl. So, <laughs> with that being said, y'all know I'm so extra sometimes. <laughs> But with that being said, let's go ahead and hop into this video. I have, as y'all can see from the beginning, I woke up, brushed my teeth, washed my face, made my bed, and I'm getting ready to go to the gym. So I started off with my, I was about to say sweet tea. I started off with my green tea. So this is what I do every morning. And like, I don't know if I mentioned in the beginning, I'm doing mine's vlog style. I'm not doing a voiceover. I want to do it vlog style. I want it to be super, super realistic. But what I do is I do this every morning. Um, I may not do it on the weekends, but I do do it throughout the week. I make me a hot cup of tea, green tea. I don't know why I keep wanting to say sweet tea. It's green tea, as you guys can see. So the brand that I drink is by Bigelow. This is the green tea with lemon. I also like the one with elderberry and vitamin C, but this is the one with just lemon in it. I will put a little bit of my collagen powder, um, honey, and a little bit of sugar, okay? I just need a little sweetness. I know that's not that good. But I do like to drink this in the morning because it craves my appetite. So I don't feel like I gotta eat right away because I don't like to eat um, before I go to the gym. I used to be a person that had to eat before I go to the gym. But now that I've started doing the gym in the morning, I don't have to eat. My body has gotten used to it. So I like to start off with a fresh cup of hot tea. This just makes me feel like very, besides the health benefits, this makes me feel productive. I know it's weird and it's like how, but I feel like I've gotten out of the bed, started my day, I'm drinking my tea and now I can be productive. So I'm about to finish my tea. I'm already dressed for the gym. Um, usually I would make my pre-workout, but I don't have any more. So I'm gonna run by GMC sometime today to get the things that I need. That's also, everything in this video is gonna tie in and it's gonna make sense. And I'm so excited to share it with you guys. Well, I mean, you're watching it now, but I'm just so excited right now. So I've already filled up my water bottle. So yeah, I have my water ready. And I'm about to get ready to go to the gym, so I'm gonna finish this tea. And then I'll catch you guys at the gym. Cause we about to get this work in, okay?
y'all so i am back home and i feel amazing as you saw your girl burned 379 active calories in an hour and a total of 472 and i just feel good like once you go to the gym and just start your day you just feel amazing now um i did go buy a tropical smoothie if you've been here a while then you know i'm addicted to tropical smoothie sunrise sunsets they are amazing great meal replacement so I'm not actually going to drink it right now i'm going to drink this probably around like 12 30. go ahead and put it in the refrigerator okay so what i'm about to do right now is make my avocado toast y'all i have been craving this i've missed my avocado toast so i do avocado fried egg and turkey bacon on wheat bread so i'm about to go ahead and wash my hands real quick so another thing that i feel is important in being that girl i love how we're referencing something in this video like we're focused on that girl and we're breaking it down so this portion of that girl and i'm gonna try to break this video down like like i said it's gonna be vlog style real relaxed real realistic but i'm gonna point out different points so right now we're focusing on like the health and the workouts and um clean eating so this is pretty much on the cleaner side of things for me. About to have breakfast, which is pretty healthy. And then I'm going to have a cup of orange juice and also take my vitamins. But yeah, that's a part of, you know, just being that girl. If you don't want to go to the gym, then that's okay. Maybe drink you like a detox drink or drink your tea, drink you a lot of water. You don't even have to go to the gym. You can do an at-home workout. That's so let me hush and let's start breakfast. about to start the self-care portion and with that I'm not gonna actually like show you guys what I'm doing but I am going to show you the stuff that I'm gonna use of course as women we want to feel our best when you look your best when you feel your best so with that comes hygiene and self-care I'm gonna start with my skincare first I'm gonna go in with my CeraVe foaming facial wash I'm going to tone with this um, rose deep hydration toner by fresh also going to go in with my olay that is the olay vitamin c serum i'm gonna go in with this olay this is the uh, total effect seven in one moisturizer and it is fragrance free because i do have sensitive skin and then i'm also going to go ahead and shave my arms and my legs i'm gonna do that in the shower of course we like to use the satin care sensitive gel as well as the big sensitive um razors this is what i use and then in the shower i use the dr bonner's this is the tea tree soap i then go in with my exfoliant sorry could you say that again girl sorry, hush ain't nobody talking to you what you said you want to exfoliate and then after that i'm going to go in and moisturize my body with this olay this is the Olay Cleansing and Brightening Vitamin C Body Wash. And then last, we are going to go in with our moisturizer. And yes, I use this OG. I'm talking about our mamas used to use this. This is the Queen Helen Cocoa Butter. I'm going to go over that with this Fenty. This is the buttercream because I need to be buttered up girl i need to be moisturized the skin cannot be dry okay so yeah that's what i do and of course last i will go over my body with a fragrance but all of my perfumes are in my beauty room so i can't show you which one i'm going to use today because i don't even know yet so i'm about to take me a hot shower and then i will check in with you guys a little bit later hey y'all so i'm fresh out of the shower your girl feels amazing y'all 
Mm, I smell delicious, okay? Getting ready to head out. I'm gonna go ahead and go to my lash appointment. We about to feel like that girl, about to go get these lashes done. We finna feel like that girl without makeup, okay? Cause you all know, lashes just make you feel so beautiful without makeup, so I'm excited. I'm gonna try to vlog, well, I'm not gonna promise you guys footage because it's kind of hard to vlog while you're getting your lashes done. Like, you can kind of start off like showing where you're at if the person allows that, and then you can kind of show you laying on the bed a little bit. When you're finished, you can show footage, but as far as like vlogging while you're getting your lashes done, it's kind of hard because you can't expect your lash tech to record for you. So, um, because you're literally laying there for like an hour and 30 to two hours, depending on who you go to. But all right, y'all, I got everything I need. Got my keys, got my bag. Let's go get these lashes done. Oh, oh, we can take it slow. Stay up till the morning. Oh, we're just taking this moment. So it's later and I'm checking in. Your girl did her makeup, but look at my lashes. Ah, my girl did that, okay? They look amazing. I went with volume and I did 12, 14, and 15 on the length. And I love it, okay? I'm glad that I went with volume this time. Or I'm just glad that I went a little bit heavier because the first time, if y'all remember the first time I got my lashes done, baby, you could not even tell that your girl got her lashes done, okay? It just looked like lashes were a little bit longer. They were cute, but they were not giving what these are giving. So I'm super excited. I'm super happy. I definitely will be going back. But yeah, y'all, I'm feeling like, y'all already know what I'm finna say. Y'all already know what I'm finna say. Your girl is already feeling like that girl, okay? We have done, sorry, I was just shaking the heck out of this camera. But we have already done a lot of stuff. Your girl is feeling so good. I feel accomplished, okay? I feel like I have done a lot today, which I really haven't done much, but I'm feeling good about myself. So keep that in mind when you guys are on your that girl routine. Do what makes you happy. And if you feel like you're doing two things for the day, puts you in that spirit or in that mood of feeling like you are that girl, you are. And don't let anybody tell you any otherwise. So all I have left to do today for myself that I'm going to film and share with you guys is I'm about to go get my nails done because I love getting my nails done. Okay. I love what my nails look like after I get them done. I don't like sitting in the chair getting my nails done, if that makes sense. So, I'm about to go get my nails done. And then after that, I'm going to treat myself to something good tonight for dinner. I don't care if it's healthy or not. I'm going to treat myself because it's been a great day. That makes me feel good. And yeah, so we're just going to go from there. And of course, I'm going to bring you guys with me to the nail salon. But anyways, enough of me talking. Let's go ahead and get to the nail salon. <laughs> Okay, my hair looks a mess. It doesn't even look like I attempted to curl it. My curls have fallen, but who cares? That doesn't mean that I'm not still that, that what? That girl. So, I got my nails done, as you guys can see. As you can see, I did get my nails done. They're so pretty. It's a peachy and white color marble, but I did go by a seafood spot and got me a crab bowl and some fried shrimp. So I'm about to enjoy one of my favorite meals. It may not be the healthiest, but it is one of my favorite meals. I'm super excited about it. So I'm about to go set everything up, put on one of my favorite YouTubers, drink me some wine, and just enjoy the night. This is definitely something that you can do all the time. So yeah, I'm just gonna treat myself to one of my favorite meals, kick back, relax, and do exactly what it is that I want to do for the rest of this evening. So. Let's go set this up and we'll go from there. Hey, Ricky, babe. 
baby so it's the next day happy sunday well when you guys are watching this it may be a wednesday or a sunday but happy sunday is march 6th it's 11 20 your girl got up this morning i had breakfast i made me another avocado toast and i did a smoothie on the side i did a protein smoothie i'll show you guys what i put in my smoothie real quick so this right here is the protein powder that i use it's by orgain it's their organic protein and my flavor is peanut butter so I do that with frozen strawberries and then I also put some more peanut butter a banana and some almond milk so I didn't show this to y'all yesterday I forgot um, but these are the vitamins that I take I usually do the Vita fusion but um, they were out of them at Walmart so my husband picked up these for me which is the multivitamin for her by nature made and then I just have been drinking this right here. This is the emergency vitamin C. Don't be looking at my armpits, y'all, because y'all know that's what we're gonna do today. I'm about to continue the maintenance portion for this video. I'm super excited. Well, I'm excited but anxious because we're going to get a wax, okay? We're going to get a bazillion and we're going to get our armpits because summertime is coming. We need to be smooth and bare. It's just the whole after feeling of having a wax. It just feels so clean, so feminine. I'm going to go ahead and head out, head to the wax place and then i'm going to hit a couple other spots um i do want to treat myself so we're also going to get into that as well so with that being said let's go ahead and get out the door errands and your girl feels good okay i'm feeling like a brand new woman everything is complete you guys everything is complete everything everything nails lashes eyebrows everything everything the only thing that's left is probably like a hot bath and i'll probably do that tonight before i go to bed but anyways i'm back home i'm about to get ready to meal prep so let's talk about why i meal prep okay meal prepping for me it just sets the tone for the week it's always part of my sunday reset um i like to meal prep because for one i am super super busy so in order to avoid me feeling drained or tired or just not wanting to get in the kitchen and cook i like to meal prep so that it is out of the way for the week so with that being said on sundays i like to try to meal prep alone makes me feel like i'm sticking to my goals as far as like fitness and it just holds you accountable so don't feel discouraged if you don't meal prep or you feel like i want to meal prep but i don't have the healthiest meals and meal prepping is not just about the healthiest meals okay it's about saving money and you are holding yourself accountable and you can make whatever meals you want if you want to meal prep spaghetti or if you want to meal prep soul food whatever it is you can meal prep so don't feel like oh my gosh i can't meal prep because i don't know the healthiest meals i don't meal prep the healthiest meals but i do meal prep things that are more healthy than of course rolling through zaxby's and chick-fil-a and burger king and all of that stuff like that those are not the healthiest foods okay there's a lot of salt they're gonna add a lot of weight and they're gonna throw us off of our fitness goals so in order to feel like that girl we want our bodies to be snatched we want to look good and with that being said in order for me to stay on my goals i like to meal prep so with that being said i'm gonna go ahead and get ready to meal prep tonight i'm going to be cooking some honey glazed baked chicken with some jasmine rice and asparagus pretty simple and easy but before i cook i want to show you guys what i purchased today now i mentioned that i was going to be treating myself and i did but i did some home decor shopping but i'm actually working on another vlog as well while i'm doing this video so the home decor stuff i'm not going to share with you but i did get three little items for myself i ran into target because i needed some more of my collagen so this is the collagen that i was telling you guys about in the beginning of the video that i put into my green tea every morning now if you are a og then you know i talk about this all the time so i love this stuff i talk about it in almost every video and on top of that i just picked up two jewelry pieces um i picked up these really cute 
gold earrings right here. And then I picked up this set of bracelets. It's just three pretty gold bracelets. Now I don't like jewelry that you can hear. I'm not a girl that you wear the jewelry and you can hear it. I hate this. Oh my God, it makes me cringe. It makes me cringe. So I'll probably just wear one, but I love these. They're super cute. I'm a gold jewelry girl, okay? If you're a gold jewelry girl, let me know. But I'm a gold jewelry girl, so I have to wear gold. And then last, I went to a different wax spot because mine was actually booked. So I went to European Wax. I've never been there before. I had a good experience. The place is really, really nice. Um, but I did pick up two items. So this product right here, this is the body polish and this one is aloe so i'm super excited to try this it is supposed to help with hair growth minimizing and ingrown hairs and then i also picked up the serum to go along with that as well so this right here is gonna fall into like my daily self-care and i'm super excited about it self-care is very very important and we always want to take care of ourselves from the inside out so that's what I purchased today. I'm going to put that up in a little bit, but now we're gonna go ahead and get straight into meal prep. reached the end of this video your girl just finished meal prepping i cleaned the kitchen poured me a cup of wine while the food was cooking i also did some planning i jotted down some things in my calendar and i also wrote down some content ideas in my notebook so y'all i'm feeling good okay your girl is feeling good i am tired but i'm feeling so good so accomplished i feel like i have done everything that i could possibly do to make myself feel good and feel like i'm that girl so with that being said your girl is about to go ahead and close out this vlog i really hope you guys enjoyed this video keep in mind you can do whatever it is that makes you feel like you're that girl don't feel pressure don't feel like another person does too much and you're not doing enough it's whatever makes you feel good my whole thing about being that girl is i just feel like it's basically being productive at the same time remembering to take care of yourself i hope this video motivates you to spend a couple days or a week whatever it takes for you to complete this process and i know the video is titled how to become that girl and i know you see videos like this i know we see the vlogs we see the tiktoks ultimate guide to being that girl how to become that girl that is a title okay you need to remember and you need to know that you are already that girl i am already that girl you are already that girl we're not becoming we're maintaining being what we already are and we all are that girl so give yourself a pat on the back sis 
tell yourself that you're doing a good job because you are and make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up leave your girl a comment why am i holding this wine glass like this <laughs> Make sure you guys give your girl a thumbs up, leave me a comment, share the video, and don't forget to hit the red subscribe button. Join the Brookie Baby gang because the Brookie Babies are lit. We have fun. And if you subscribe, you're going to have some fun too. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next one. Brookie Babies. Cheers. <laughs>